Hey, what's going on, everybody? Happy Monday. Hope you had a great weekend. Got eight matchups on this NHL slate for today. <clears throat> Before I get started, go ahead and like and subscribe. Support the channel. Getting closer to 3K subs, which is awesome. Amazing growth. And um, yeah, we're going to get right into these um, into these picks. Eight matchups here. A lot of action. Starting with the Montreal Canadiens. First, the Calgary Flames. Montreal 2017-9. Calgary 21 23 and 3. Calgary opening opening up as favorites at minus 125 with the over under at five and a half. Last 10 games for Montreal, 3 and 7 in their last 10. Calgary 5 and 5 in their last 10. Montreal just 1 and 6 in their last 7 meetings with Calgary here. 1 and 4 on the road against Calgary, so not a lot of success here against, you know, against Calgary. Calgary 4 and 1 at home against Montreal. Uh, these teams just played, you know, on a third game of their series. Calgary winning 5-2, 4-2. I expect the same thing here. Montreal just struggling against Calgary. Going to roll with Calgary at minus 125. Going to go with the Let's see. We'll go with the over 5 and a half as well. Both last both games hit over. I think this one hit over as well. Next matchup, we have the Colorado Avalanche. First, the St. Louis Blues. Colorado 31, 10, and 4. St. Louis 20, 19, and 6. Colorado opening up his favorites at minus 155. St. Louis plus 135 with the over under at 6. Last 10 games for Colorado, 8 and 2 in their last 10. St. Louis 4 and 6 in their last 10. Colorado 4 and 1 on the road right now. 5 and 1 in their last 6. 5 and 1 in their last 6 against St. Louis. St. Louis just 4 and 10 in their last 14. Kind of a bad stretch here for St. Louis. They are they are coming off a win against Colorado 5 to 3. I love Colorado to bounce back in this one here. Um, going to roll Colorado. Going to go with the under 6. Next matchup we have the Vancouver Canucks versus the Ottawa Senators. Vancouver 19 19 and 3. Ottawa 17, 27, and 4. Vancouver opening up his favorites at minus 120 with the over under at 6. And Ottawa's plus 100. Last 10 games for Vancouver. 6 and 4 in their last 10. Ottawa 4 and 6 in their last 10. Um, these teams, you know, on a third game, third game of their series right here. Vancouver winning the last matchup 4 to 2, losing the first one 3 0. Um, Vancouver 6 and 1 in their last 7 against Ottawa. 4 and 1 on the road against Ottawa here. I think this is a better spot for Vancouver. Uh going to roll Vancouver since you know Ottawa got the last one. Uh Vancouver better at, better on the road here against uh, Ottawa. Going to roll with Vancouver at minus 120. And we're going to go with the over. Well no, we're going to go with the under 6. I like the under 6. Next matchup, we have the Carolina Hurricanes versus the Dallas Stars. Carolina 31, 10, and 6. Dallas 20, 15, and 12. Carolina opening up as favorites at minus 120. Dallas plus 100 with the over under at 5.5. Last 10 games for Carolina, 6 and 4 in their last 10. Dallas 7 and 3 in their last 10 here. Carolina. You know, five and one in their last six meetings against Dallas. Dallas playing really well right now. Five and one in their last six um, at home and straight up as well. Both teams playing good here. Um, we know Carolina's had more success head to head against Dallas. Seven and three in their last ten against Dallas. I'm gonna roll with Carolina. Such a small spread. I'll take the team that's had more success against Dallas. Um, Love Carolina here at minus 120. Don't hate don't hate the underdog play, especially Dallas on the plus one or plus one and a half on the puck line. I think that's a good play as well. Gonna go Carolina minus 120. Gonna go with the over five and a half. Next matchup, we have the Florida Panthers versus the Nashville Predators. Florida 31, 13, and 5. Nashville 26, 21, and 2. Florida opening up as favorites at minus 120. Nashville plus 100 with the over-under at five and a half. Last 10 games for Florida, 5-5 five and five in their last 10. Nashville, 6-4 and four in their last 10. 
Florida 4 and 1 in their last 5 meetings with Nashville. 6 and 1 on the road against Nashville here. Uh Nashville 1 and 6 at home against Florida. Having some struggles with Florida here. You know, I think it's going to be another close one here. I think Florida pulls it out. Better success head to head on Nashville. Um I like Florida here. I think it's going to be a close game too, so I do like Nashville on the puck line. Take Florida money line and we'll go with the over five and a half. Next matchup, we have the Edmonton Oilers versus the Winnipeg Jets. Edmonton 27 16 and 2. Winnipeg 27 17 and 3. Both teams currently minus 110 with the over under at six. Last 10 games for Edmonton 6 and 4 in their last 10. Winnipeg 5 and 5 in their last 10 here. Edmonton 4 and 2 in their last 6, 4 and 1 in their last 5 meetings with Winnipeg. Uh, Edmonton winning the head to head battle here, 6 3 and 1 in their last 10 meetings against Winnipeg. Winnipeg just 1 and 5 at home in their last 6, 2 and 4 in their last 6. Kind of a bad stretch here for, for Winnipeg. Um, gonna roll with the team that's that's had better head to head success here. And, um, you know, Winnipeg riding a nice little three-game losing streak here. I'm going to roll with Edmonton on the money line. We're going to go with the under six. Next matchup, we have the Anaheim Ducks First the Los Angeles Kings. Anaheim 14-27-7. The Kings 17-22-6. LA opening up his favorites at minus 155 with the over-under at 5.5. Last 10 games for Anaheim, 3-7 in their last 10. LA, 3-7 in their last 10 as well. Anaheim, you know, 1-4 in their last 5. Not a, LA is 1-4 in their last 5 as well. Both teams just not playing very good good hockey right now. Um, not a game I'm excited to bet on here. Going to roll with, you know, the underdog play in Anaheim in a matchup that they could easily win outright. Going to take Anaheim on the money line. Definitely on the puck line, too. Going to go with the over five and a half. Last matchup on the board, we have the Arizona Coyotes versus the San Jose Sharks. Arizona 21, 22, and 5. San Jose 18, 24, and 5. Both teams currently minus 110 with the over under at five and a half. Last 10 games for Arizona, three and seven in their last 10. San Jose one and nine in their last 10. Um, Arizona five and one in their last six against San Jose. Uh, they are just two and seven in their last nine. Arizona not playing very good right now, but neither is San Jose. San Jose three, four, five, seven on an eight game losing streak here. <sighs> is you know neither team playing hot here, but I can't trust San Jose at this point on a bad losing streak. Uh, don't know when that next win's gonna come, and I don't really want to wait for it gonna go with arizona at minus 110 gonna go with the under five and a half that's gonna do it for the video hopefully you guys enjoyed it go ahead and like and subscribe and um and yeah good luck with your picks and parlays on monday hope you guys get off to a great start for the week and i'll see you guys on tuesday have a good one